As we know from Newton's first law of motion that an object will continue its state of motion unless acted upon by some net force. The second law continues from there, describing what will happen if there is some net force acting on it. Newton's second law of motion tells us that force equals mass times acceleration, or F equals ma. Here we have an object of 1 kilogram and it is at rest. If we apply 1 Newton force on it for 5 seconds, according to the equation, the acceleration of the object will be 1 meter per second square for that 5 seconds. As a result, the velocity will be changed from 0 to 5 meter per second by that time. And after that, although there is no force being applied, the object will keep moving without changing its velocity according to Newton's first law. Newton's second law can be rephrased to state that the acceleration an object experiences, is directly proportional to the force applied on it, that is the greater force we apply on an object, the greater acceleration that object will experience. And the acceleration an object experiences, is inversely proportional to its mass. The greater mass an object has, the less acceleration that object will experience. 